Here's Abscess by Steve D. Six maps in a fairly old school style. I'm on PR Boom Plus. Let's give this thing a go. We will try this on Hurt Me Plenty. He says it's kind of rough, so... First map has 115 enemies, two secrets, 16 items. Nice creepy music. I thought I saw a commando up there. Well, we start with a lot of humans to deal with. Lots of humans. Oh wow. The map seems to be, uh, I wouldn't say scarcely, but uh, reservedly detailed. It's, de it's plenty detailed, it's just not like in your face with all sorts of colors and stuff. I like the uh, view to the outdoors here. I didn't actually expect that to be a secret. Shotgun. Wait, was that a secret? No. Okay. I'm not sure if I opened that door or the monster did, to be honest. But in any case... Hmm... Well, I guess I'll have to get that another way. Kind of, uh, hanger-ish, don't you think? Yeah, maybe a little bit too much of the star gray, but I like how it's, you know, bending around geometrically. Nice slime pool. Alright. So, what are we gonna do? We're gonna go this way. Slime. There's the exit, blue key exit. Hmm. Just not this level's not that big, so I don't think it's that big a deal that it wasn't super obvious what the switch did. Um yeah, so it lowers that up. Yeah, that was about the only thing you could have done, basically, so... It's green armor. Yeah, this kind of feels like a TNT room. It's kind of empty, and uh, there's not a lot of detail to it. Although the lighting is pretty detailed with, I believe, three, maybe even four uh, different sectors of lighting. All right, so let's just keep going. Double staircase.
I don't even know why I tried to do that. Obviously, that's an impassable fence. All right, let's go up here. Got two switches. Not sure what they do, but again, it's a short level. Presumably, I'll be able to get the blue key somewhere now. Just hoping maybe the armor would be down. Um, so yeah, this over here was blocked by, uh, I don't remember what, probably something similar. Ah, a little bit of health. Hmm. Okay, that's a secret. Blue armor's gotta be the other secret, but I'm just not sure how to get it. Or maybe that's a secret. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I thought that might be a trigger to fall onto there. But no such luck. Alright, we'll just, uh... We'll just carry on then. So, let's go down that other hallway here. I feel like I'm closer to done with this map than I actually am. I only got 43 monsters killed. The imps come to party. Ow. Uh, let's see what's on the other side. Alright, these are a bunch of doors. Eh, we'll, we'll carry on. We'll just carry on. Yeah, see, here's a, here's some nice detail right here. Um, yeah, so far I, I like the map. It's uh, it's big, you know. It's got a lot of big areas. Um, just a nice sense of adventure, I guess. That kind of cool little thing there. Gotta try not to go in the slime, but you also gotta try not to. Shotguns to death. Then the shotguns come down. Yeah, at least two of them do. Couple more switches. I wonder if I have to hit both of them to bring the blue key down. Oh, there you go. It's almost like a mini secret. Yeah, very, very Doom 1 ish. <clears throat> Which makes sense considering this wad was originally created way back in uh, the late 90s. These doors took the liberty of opening. Or at least this one did. Yikes, a lot of commandos. Not a lot of chain guns for me. Ow. Got them both. One more in.
Yeah, there are a lot of different locations in this map. And with only two secrets, there's a lot of like... Semi-secrets, it seems like. Things opening up, a lot of optional, it seems, content, because I have the blue key, so I can, I think, go exit whenever I want. Oh, okay, so a bunch of these have opened up now. Three more enemies. Two more enemies. Yeah, these are all over the place. Okay. Guess that'll do it then. Graveyard, huh? All right. So yeah, kind of a fun opening map. Uh, there was kind of a lot to that map, but it wasn't all really necessary because um, there's a lot of like optional content, semi secrets. Uh, it reminded me of, of Doom One for sure, just because of kind of the sense of adventure a little bit. Um, it wasn't like overly interconnected or maze like. But uh, just the way that it flowed and progressed kind of reminded me of Doom 1. Uh, not, not heavily detailed, but enough uh, detail going on to make it not look bad. It looks pretty decent. And uh, pretty much all humans. A few imps, a few demons, but a lot of humans in the combat. So, again, pretty, pretty Doom 1-ish. Uh, we'll see where the map goes from here as far as the combat. Eh. Maybe I'll switch to Ultraviolet, so don't, who knows, we'll see uh, how things go. But, uh, yeah, it does what it's supposed to do. It's, it's got me intrigued, so I'll uh, continue playing this wad, see what we get ourselves into. This is uh, Steve D's wad from uh, several years ago, and it's called Abscess. <laughs> 